What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl the Hijabi Hermione. Uh, on the last video we just ran through the um, tutorial levels of Tomb Raider and today we're going to jump straight into the first level. So uh, without further ado, let's go! What's a man got to do to get that kind of attention from you? It's hard to say exactly, but you seem to be doing fine. Well, great. Though truth is, it ain't me that wants you. Oh? No, Miss Jacqueline Natla does, from Natla Technologies. You know, creator of all things bright and beautiful. <laughs> Seal it, Larson. Ma'am. Feast your eyes on this, Lara. How does that make your wallet rumble? I'm sorry. I only play for sport. Then you'll like a big park. Peru. Vast mountain ranges to cover. Sheer walls of ice. Rocky crags. Savage winds. And there's this little trinket. An age-old artifact of mystical power is buried in the unfound tomb of Qualapec. That's my interest. You could leave tomorrow. Are you busy tomorrow? Okay, there we are. Good. Okay, so let's just jump straight in, I guess. Um, I'm mostly familiar with this level. Uh, let's see if I can find everything. Um, we'll see how it goes. And our first traps. Okay. <laughs> Don't want to get hit by those. I think some of my health took a hit. Okay. Uh, I know the game wants me to go up there, but I know there's something down this side. Um, okay, it's up there. Uh, yeah, I think there's two ways you can approach this. You can either climb up. Oh, this is something I didn't speak about. So surfaces like um, this one up here that are at, at such an angle, I think 45 degrees or more, she will slide down them no matter what you do. So actually, if I jump on this, she's just going to slide down like that. Um, so there's two ways you can get up here. She can jump on these surfaces. 
So one way is you jump up, grab the edge, and you climb up over. And if you can time it just right, you jump forward and grab the edge. But that's a little difficult. So what I like to do is jump backwards, hold down, jump. And she just does this really cool thing. She's such a badass. Oh, that was a secret. Okay. Uh, yes. So this is a health pickup. If you press action, she should pick it up. And that's a small one. Oh, I pressed escape to open the menu, by the way. Um, that's a small mid pack, which will heal about half my health bar. I have more than enough health at the moment. I don't need that. And that's her pistols. The only weapon she uses. Compass? Oh, okay. So I guess that points me north. I don't know what the use of that is. <laughs> um, if I press down, it'll take me to the menu. All of that stuff. And then it's not here yet, but if I press up from here, it'll also take me to all the little extra items that she finds, like keys, artifacts, cool things like that. That's like a special inventory. And if I press action here, it will actually select the object. So if I select the pistols, for example, she will take those out and I can actually fire them by pressing action. Um, they've got a weird sort of black outline on them. Um, guess that must just be what happens when you play a DOS game in Windows 10. Uh, I can actually take these out by pressing spacebar, and if I press spacebar, she'll put them away as well. Um, so yeah, let's get out of here and back on the main path. These sound effects are so good. Like, this music is actually freaking me out. <laughs> it's not- I, I'm not used to this music, like, this is PlayStation music. Oh, okay, first enemies. Bats. So, she targets them automatically, as you can see. They only need like one gunfire to actually take them out, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, um, those are in it. Those are easy enemies, which is not a problem. Um, is that? That's so funny. It's like an opening that is just like snowed in. I don't know what that is. And I think there's a secret up here as well. But I think you have to stand to the left because she can't reach it otherwise. Yeah, there we go. Oh, she can jump really high. <gasps> bat. Okay, let's take it out. Oh, she was missing that bat. Okay. Um, another health pickup. Great. Okay, she's not quite on top of it. Got to step back. Perfect. All right, Lara. I'm just going to quick save here. Uh, you do that by pressing F5. Opens up the save menu and then action save um i know a lot of people think like in most games that you let's play it's not normal to save all the time but at least with the classic two meter games i think there's an you should make an exception like because lara is squishy like she can die really easily so i think it's just good habit to like save when you remember to so i'll i'll save regularly not too regularly but every now and then so we must be entering the ruins now as of those bricks there and some more bricks here Ooh. Okay. Random pillar in the middle. Um, maybe it's natural. Lots of greenery this side. Aha! Secret passage. And that looks like a door, if my memory serves me correctly. And this here's a switch. So you just run up to it and you press action. Oh, that sound effect. That's so creepy. Bat! <laughs> I don't know, are these like vampire bats that they want to eat you all the time? <laughs> okay. Now, there's no way through this door. Um, but it allows you to see the passage on the other side with the big door, which is cool. Um, so we have to find our way out somewhere else. Which looks like it's on the far side of the room. So let's head there. Okay, let's just see what's behind us. Nothing. Okay, carrying on. Ooh. I remember this room. Ah, and there's wolves down there. Nice. Okay, so I could, in principle, um, just shoot them from up here, but let's have some fun. <laughs> Like I said, no cheese, right? 
Okay, this is gonna be interesting. This could go co totally wrong. Oh. Okay, got him. And another one. Okay. Is that it? Any more baddies out here? Nothing? Ooh, random statue. Huh. If that's a person, then it doesn't look like they died very nicely. <laughs> Okay, what's under here? Nothing. Okay. Lovely. Let's see if we can climb back up. She should be able to reach this. Come on. Or every time she jumps, she moves a little bit more forward, so she will eventually grab it. There we go. Okay, we came from over there, so let's go explore this side. This music is so creepy, though. Like, how does Lara handle this? this was my job, I'd freak out because of the sound. I mean, okay, mind you, in real life, you wouldn't hear this music, but... <laughs> Ooh, what's above us? Another snowed-in opening. How does that happen? <laughs> Probably they want you to use the front door. I mean, that makes sense. Ooh, okay. Wow, that is beautiful. I don't know if that was there when I played this last. Um, maybe that's because of the patch. I don't know. Okay, now I know there's... Okay, I'm not going to say anything. Let's just go for it. Oh my gosh! No, Lara. You cannot die here. No! Oh, that was so nerve-wracking. Like, ah, oh, I hadn't done that before. I'm so used to shooting from upstairs. Oh, bears are scary. Ah. Oh. Oh man, and he actually looks so cute and fuzzy, like a teddy bear, a big teddy bear. Okay. Oh, okay, so that floor panel must open the door. Another health pack. Do I actually need this? Nah, no, not yet. Alright, let's get out of here. Okay, so I would have had to fight these wolves anyway, <laughs> from the looks of things. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, so this time let's just jump straight across. It would be cool if I could swing on these things, but... I oh no! No! <laughs> okay, this is why you get a proper running jump and you don't do what I just did. Is my health... Yeah. Mm, I don't know. Let's see if I can make it without using the health pack. Oh no. I have to run all the way back. Okay. Come on, Lara. Run faster. I think she can only sprint in the third game. Oh yeah, that's what I was going to say. She can only swing, I think, in the fourth game onwards. This is her first outing, so that's not going to happen. Okay, let's walk to the edge. <laughs> I'm being so extra careful here, but I don't want to have to repeat this. Okay. Um, let's see what's down the sides. This is the thing with two meters. Sometimes there's like hidden collectibles down these side paths. So you just want to be extra thorough. And I was right. There's one back there. music that's not good ah! you're not gonna get me I refuse I refuse down yeah <laughs> that was actually really badass I did that really quickly and this music is so cool man Okay, 
Okay, I'm going up here because I know this is a secret. Wait for the music to end. Ooh, those tubular bells. Awesome. Ah, perfect. The music from Tomb Raider is always just so on point. Okay. Aha, uh -huh, our first large med pack. So this will heal 100% of my health. So you use this when your health is really low, basically. Okay. Is that like a sundial? Oh, no, but that doesn't make sense. There's no sun here. Oh, duh. Why did I say that? Um, <laughs> I don't know what that is. Calendar? I mean, who who was it that was in Peru? Was it... Is, it wasn't the Mayans, was it? Was it the Incas? The Aztecs? I don't know. Yeah, I'm from Africa, so... <laughs> definitely would not know these things. Uh, okay, let's go up this side. Back to that creepy music. Can't I have that badass music again? Okay, uh, I guess that opens the door. Is there anything? Doesn't look like any pickups that I'm missing. Okay. Um. Okay. Let's get across there. And up. And there we go. Good job, Lara. Ooh. I love the music. Oh, no! Okay, I think I should use a health pack. This is getting ridiculous. <laughs> I've got so many anyway. Okay, that did the job. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> Okay, uh, for those who don't know these floor tiles, uh, well, I guess you'll see what they do. This is what they do. Yeah, so you always want to be careful when you walk over them because there could be like spikes underneath or something. Who knows? Oh, what's out here? Ah, okay. I see. I see. This was the tunnel we were looking in, not, not tunnel, passageway we were looking in earlier. Uh, I guess we've just arrived from the top. So I guess we want to get through that door, but it's closed right now. And those rocks must obviously uh, lead up here on the other side. Okay, so we're on the right path. Just keep going around. Come on, let's see if I can do the running jump. Yes! <laughs> that was so risky. But it's a good habit to get used to. Ah, here we go again. Where are you? Uh, you're not getting me. Is there one coming from behind? Is that it? I guess that's it. Okay. <laughs> but this music is so cool. I love it. Okay. I'm not going to wait for it this time. Oh, it ended earlier anyway. Okay, door is open. That's good. Okay, let's... Um, I think this might be slightly too high. Oh, I don't know why I'm saving. I'm pretty sure this is the end of the level. Let's go down like this. So I don't get hurt. Oh, are those like... Um, dart traps that will shoot the darts like earlier? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> I should have seen that coming. Okay. Oh yeah, there we go. Three out of three secrets. That was pretty cool. Okay. Um, so that's it for the first level. Um, yeah, I mean, three out of three. I don't know if I can keep that going next time. We'll just have to see. Uh, 15 minutes. That's not bad. I think most levels are like half an hour. And when you get to the later games, like two made of three, they go like over an hour. So I will have to break those up when I get there. But 15 minutes is pretty good. Yeah, and a two to one <laughs> kill to pick up ratio. That's pretty funny. Um, yeah, so uh, thanks so much for watching, guys. Um, if you enjoyed it, be sure to like, share and subscribe. Hit that bell icon so you don't miss any future episodes. And I'll see you next time. Tot ziens.